What is going on guys? I'm back with a new video. PUBG gave me 10 codes to give away for the event pass. If you want to win, click the link in the description. I will give codes away to 10 lucky random people that enter the giveaway. Also, before I get into the video, G Fuel is doing a 40% off sale with the discount code NINJA40. If you want to get G Fuel, now is the time. The discount will only last for one week and if you use my discount code you are supporting me and the channel click the link in the description check it out and don't miss out on this opportunity one of the things i've noticed is a lot of you always keep asking me about my PUBG outfit you guys leave a lot of comments asking about it and my outfit is pretty scary and unique what the fuck? If you try to hide in PUBG with regular clothes, it doesn't work well. Enemies are going to be able to see you easily. My outfit allows me to literally become almost invisible when I hide. The outfit that I use is actually very important and useful for what I do in my PUBG videos. It is the ultimate stealth ninja outfit. It is perfect for blending in, hiding in the shadows, and being sneaky. Yes, there is a ghillie suit, but getting one is very hard and rare because it can only be found in supply drops. The outfit that I use is actually better than the ghillie suit, and I know some of you are going to disagree with that, but I'm going to prove in this video why my outfit is more useful than the ghillie suit for what I do in my videos. Did I pay for my outfit? The answer is yes. All of the items for my outfit are from different types of crate collections, and most of them are locked. So you need to buy a key to unlock the crates, but I do not recommend doing that because the items that I use are not rare items. They are actually cheap common items. You will waste a lot of time and money trying to purchase keys and crates to randomly get the items that I have. The best thing to do is to actually purchase each item from the Steam Marketplace separately like I did. Almost every item for my outfit is under a dollar except for my face mask. The total cost for all the items that I use for my outfit is just under $10 and you may already have some of them in your inventory from just playing the game. Now before I get into the items that I use, you may have noticed that my character is a female. Why did I go with the female? Well there is a good reason for that. The female body in PUBG is actually a little smaller than the male body. The arms are skinnier and the waist is smaller and because of this little thing it helps when you're hiding in a bush because you're going to be less noticeable due to your body being slightly smaller. The goal for my outfit was to cover as much skin as I could so I can be a true ninja on PUBG. For my head, I have a gray beanie. This beanie is from the biker crate and it's only 4 cents. Like I said, I do not recommend buying keys to waste time and money. For my eyes, I use the punk glasses. These are actually from the wanderer crate which is a free crate. A lot of you might already have these from just playing the game. If you don't, the punk glasses are on the Steam Marketplace just like everything else. Now for my face mask, I use the Twitch Prime Balclava. This mask is from the Twitch Prime crate. You can buy this mask on the Steam Marketplace for under $7. This mask is the most expensive part of my outfit, but also the most important piece for my outfit because with the punk glasses, my face is fully covered. For the torso, I have the black long sleeved turtleneck. This turtleneck is perfect for stealth. It covers your neck completely and it looks really good. It's from the Militia Crate and on the Steam Marketplace, it's under $1. For my hands, legs, and feet, these items can all be found from the Desperado Crate. I use the black punk knuckle gloves for my hands, the black baggy pants for my legs, and the black leather boots for my feet. All three of these items are less than $1 each on the Marketplace. Oh, and I also use the regular black utility belt that everyone has. Do not take your belt off because the utility belt actually gives you more storage space. So that is basically my full ninja outfit. This outfit is one of the most important things for me so I can get clips for my ninja videos. Using this outfit allows me to hide and blend in very good to the environment because I'm fully blacked out with no skin showing. I also never pick up any backpacks, helmets, or any big guns because those items are going to ruin the entire point of the outfit. It's very easy to spot a player hiding if they have a helmet on, a backpack, or a huge gun sticking out from their back. I never pick up the level 1 vest because it is super obvious and bright. I love the level 2 vest because it is black and works perfectly with the outfit. I usually stick with SMGs, pistols, and melee weapons when I go for ninja clips. 
These things do not stick out and are easy to hide with them on your body. You can also pick up throwables like grenades because they get attached to your side and you can't really see them. If you watched my PUBG Ninja montage videos, which I hope you did, you probably don't think much about my clothes, but the way that I use my outfit is very smart and it's crazy how it actually works. In my boat ninja tactic, if I'm wearing a backpack and a helmet, I'm obviously easy to spot. It's obvious that there is a player in the boat, but if I only use my outfit, I blend in with the interior of the boat perfectly and there is no backpack, helmet, or gun on my back that's going to give me away to the enemy. You can't blend in like this with a ghillie suit because the ghillie suit is meant for vegetation. Another great example of this is inside the UAZ. If I'm wearing a level 1 vest and desert camo helmet while I'm trying to be sneaky, there's clearly a player in the back. But if I only have my outfit, I perfectly blend in with the interior. I also look away with my head so people can't see my face when approaching the UAZ. This outfit allows me to become an invisible ghost if you're using it correctly like I do. Yes, the ghillie suit is useful for hiding in grass and bushes, but it is not better than this outfit. I do not recommend using it because it's not going to help you hide in vehicles. Trying to find one in game from a supply drop is also hard and you can have this outfit on all the time like I do. I hope this video helped some of you out. If it did, leave a like and comment. Make sure to use discount code NINJA40 to save 40% off G Fuel. That is a ridiculous discount to have. The sale will be ending soon, so don't miss out. I will be making a new Ninja montage soon. Thank you for all the support. It's crazy to say this, but I'm getting closer and closer to a million subscribers. If you want to see a full in-depth ninja tutorial on PUBG so you can see how I play the game, let me know in the comments. You guys are awesome, and I'm glad you all enjoy the videos that I make. What is going on guys? I'm back with a new video. PUBG gave me 10 codes to give away for the event pass. If you want to win, click the link in the description. I will give codes away to 10 lucky random people that enter the giveaway. Also, before I get into the video, G Fuel is doing a 40% off sale with the discount code NINJA40. If you want to get G Fuel, now is the